Welcome to Caseware QuickVids. In this QuickVid, we will demonstrate how to add an entity in Caseware Collaborate. An entity is a workspace that can represent a client, organization, or a department. Entities will either relate to the firm externally or internally. When a firm sets up Collaborate for the first time, a single entity is created by default. This represents the firm itself. The default entity cannot be deleted. Only users with the Create Entity permission at the firm level can add entities. To view permissions, we will navigate to Firm Settings. Then under Security, we will select Role Permissions. We'll make sure that Admin and Entities Admin both have the permissions to create an entity. There will be a C to indicate this. As you can see, the permission is granted to the Role Admin. As well, the permission is granted to the Entities Admin. Now we're ready to begin. Entities may be added to collaborate either one at a time or in a batch using a CSV file. In this demonstration, we will add an entity individually. First, navigate to the Entities app. Click the Add button and select an entity type. You will have three options from the drop-down. Clients, Internal Entities, and Other Entities. Clients represent clients of the firm. Internal entities represent divisions, departments, or subsidiaries of the firm, while other entities represent external organizations that are not clients or related to the firm, but are important for the firm to track in a central location. Examples of other entities include organizations like tax departments, banks, or lawyers. Now complete the form for the entity type that you are creating. Depending on the entity type selected, the input fields will vary. All mandatory fields are marked with an asterisk. Optionally, you can add an associated entity to create groups of two or more entities. With associated entities, you can view the activities and files from all entities in an association. Once you are done filling in the form, click OK to create the entity. Once the entity is created, you will be able to see all of its details. You can then use the Tag menu to add tags, or use the Share menu to review and modify staff and contact access to the entity. This concludes the quick vid on adding an entity. For additional resources, including documentation and online help, see the related links. Thank you for watching Casework QuickVids.